If you are like me, you already have all your wants listed. Maybe just like me, you have limited amounts to satisfy all these wants. In my case, the list would not help me satisfy my wants, but it helped me have a good glance at my wants. Maybe I was able to satisfy some while I left the others for another time. It looks call those desires left unsatisfied opportunity cost. So in simple terms, opportunity cost is alternative for good and it applies to you as an individual and to the government as well. Now let us examine this example. You're a student and you decided to buy a watch instead of a school bag. Then we say the opportunity cost of the watch bought is the school bag for good. Opportunity cost is important to you as an individual, to an organization, and even to the government. But let's see how it can be important to you as an individual first. It helps you make decisions and prioritize your wants. With opportunity cost, you can decide to get a bag since you will need it for school, and postpone a watch since you can always tell time using all other means. As an organization, a political cost helps in decision making, particularly on method of production and project execution. Now, how does opportunity cost help government? Government prepares budgets and they can't do that without looking at the opportunity cost. They always want to make decisions about how and what resources should be allocated. This is what is used in determining what roads to construct, what hospital to build, and what project to embark on at every point in time. Opportunity cost is important for everyone. Thank you for watching.